Right, hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a video on the very speed. Um, height of height of this will height at 41, but I think you'll find that um, all the haters, the 41, the 56, and whatever else has got the 48, whatever's got the very very speed, all run this system or very near to this system. Um, I just want to explain to you how it works. I've had several because after I did the cable one. Or the cable. I've had a few questions about it, and and other people commenting on it and saying how they reckon it works. So I'm just going to show you how it works, because it's easier. It's easier than trying to explain it to you and what it's what it's meant for. Um, on, a, on an automatic like scooter, like a 50 cc scooter, um, it's done with weights, and the weights alter the the pulley pulleys on it so this is done a similar way but without weights because it hasn't got the speed to spin uh, the pulleys so I'll explain how it works I'll explain what it does first what it does is the idea of it is, is so you have the engine moving high and you can move at a slower speed that's for like say long grass or you know thick, yeah, thick grass where the, you know, so it doesn't have to bring the engine revs down if you're on short grass, you can have the engine revs down, so it's not working so hard again. Um, but on a higher, sp but the actual travel travels at a higher speed. If that makes any sense to you, it basically alters the speed you're travelling at. Um, this bracket fits this way, so you have a belt in. You've had this belt here, the little one that fits in there, and that travels to the the, the gearbox. This is a roller version that fits the gearbox and then that drives the roll. This drives straight off the shaft like a normal um, a normal mower. And as you can see, well admittedly this is under, under pressure, so this is like this. And how it would normally be, is what happens is as you pull in it's a bit awkward with one you know, trying to do it on here. What happens is as you see this bit slides across this alters the depth for the pulley so the belt let's put a belt on it just roughly as you can see the, there the belt is on the outside but as, it, as you pull the, the, your cable it forces the belt down so you know, let me show you a bit better than that a bit with two belts so this belt is up higher this belt is up higher than this belt so by pulling this lever, what forces the belt in, what we say forces belt in, boom pulls this one to the top, I don't think you can see it. So now this pulley is bigger than this pulley. So it's altered the, the speed, the ratios. It's the easiest way I want to show you really. But like I say, so you pull it again, so you're pulling pressure on this pulley. This one goes down, makes this smaller, this, this, uh, this one here smaller, but makes this one bigger. And it's changing the gear in it, that's all it's doing. So if you pull on this this one, it pulls it over, it forces the belt out. And the other belt gets pulled forced in there, because obviously it's under pressure when you're you're doing it. And all it does is oh, oh this is the gear in. And that's it, that is the very drive. This little bit here. Um you always have two belts. Uh, for some reason and it seems that if you ask how your belt was changed, I always seem to change the big belt and they never change the belt to this one. I don't know why. There's a local firm near me and I know quite well that they they don't change them. But what happens is they because these get worn and they wear on the side more than I mean they look good belts. But because they wear on the side where they're going being trapped all the time. What happens then is you lose the use of your very speed because it's not forcing it up enough or it's not forcing it down enough. Um, it's the only real way I can sort of show you. But like I say, you see that one's, that one's in at the moment. I don't know how we can see it because I'm trying to look through looking black on black and it can't see it. That's right down at the moment. Uh, you can see it. Better with my hands behind it. You can see it. And then obviously as this one pulls over, as you force the cable down, it pushes it to the top. Like I so say, all it's doing is altering the ratio. 
so it alters the speed the, the diff is the same, we're travelling at the same speed, the engine's travelling at the same speed um, I know some people, are, I've seen them use the very speed just to slow down a bit um, when they're going around the borders and then they go the other way to whack it flat out to go up and down, oops, go up and down and walk just knocked everything out of the way but that's, that's basically how it works, I'm trying to get a good view of it and I can't see the camera so it's plus you've got black, black pack run. That's pulled right in. That's the other belt will force it that way when you pull the cable. It's only one cable pulling it. Spring's fighting it all the time. Spring goes on just in case you have to rebuild one of these. The spring goes in here. That hooks up just past the cable fitting. The cable fits in there and it rocks in a bolt. So like that. Not that you can see that got my hands there. <laughs> right okay it's very quick, quick it's very simple um, but I have heard so many comments on what it is they reckon people reckon it does and how it works um, it's unreal but like I say it's only because the, the tension I remember all that does is slide because the pressure of the belt you're pushing on them it finds the easiest option so it's either speeding you up or slowing you down very simple Alright, that's something else I just want to mention. Right, I just want to mention something else. And that's uh, my Twitter account. If anyone's interested. Um, I have got the I have got the old one and this and a new one. Uh, they're both uh, the Ketley Mower repairs. Um, but unfortunately I don't use the old one. So, we've set a new one up, set a new one up. Um, so, it's now... Ketley Mower Repairs, but if you want to go on it the easy way and find it, because obviously there's two under that name, um, you need at Repair Mower. Um, if you've got Ketley Mower Repairs in on Twitter and you get the one with me, my ugly face, probably really get with a, a goatee, then you're wasting your time on that one because I'm not using that one anymore. Um, so this is the one, I'm trying to get it up. If you can see it, it's. Um, this is the one that comes up now. I think you'll find it's got the same background as the other one. But at the moment it's got Louis on the, the Murray. Um, don't know how well you can see that. I can't see it at all. <laughs> but you'll know if it's the one. It's the one with Louis on it. Um, and by the way, I have to have the green case because the kids have had their choices first. So all the nice black ones and red and blue and all the rest of the kind. Mind you, I quite like green, so it probably looks brown and shitty on here, but there you go. There you go, that's, um, like I say, if you want to look me up on uh, Twitter, it's at Repair Mower. And obviously I've got Facebook. Um, I don't use Facebook very often because I don't like Facebook very much. Um, but if you go on Ketley Mower Repairs, I have got a thing on there, um, an account on there. Um, but it has got, I think, about 300 photos of lawnmowers and wacker plates and all kinds of things I've worked on over the last couple of years. So I don't update that very often. Um, but I do go on it, I suppose, once a month or something just to have a little look. So you can message me that way if you need to. Or Twitter seems to be the thing I'm on quite a bit now. Just because it's quick and easy. Okay. Um, Right, that's enough about that, that rubbish. Yeah. Well, I'll uh, say I haven't done video for a little while now, but I've got I'm um, half a dozen to, to to put up. So hopefully they will be up around about the same time. There's got to be two or three on there online at the moment. Uh, I'm not going to bore you with it because I've just done another video about the brackets for this, and I think that tells you more about the things that will come in and whatever. And that'll probably be up before this one. So, like I say, the very drive, all it is is this. Moves about under the pressure you pull on the lever. Forces one belt down. And obviously when you go the other way, it forces the other way. So I'm just trying to think what way it is actually. If you pull it, when you pull the cable, it would pull it. Da, 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 push. When you pull the cable back, forces it forward. So that would push a drive belt down more. And put that on there, so that would what that do? That would speed. That would speed it up. And then when you push it forward, 
it would pull no that's wrong yeah when you push it forward it goes that way so it would slow it down if not if that ain't right it's the other way around <laughs> I don't know I only fix the bleeding things um, <laughs> but, but obviously to get that bracket what I mentioned on the other video I say it might not be up yet um, you need to take it off because it'll you struggle um, but it's not that much to it uh, we are looking probably a, an hour or so work uh, yeah it is an hour or so well, obviously I've got an advantage here because I haven't got the roller in in here oh, sorry the roller's missing um, but that's another story what I'm going to do a bit later on if I haven't already mentioned it um, it's quite windy though as well considering that we've had all this hot weather we've had uh, another little storm uh, not long back it looks like it's going to pee down so hopefully I'll get these on tonight because Louis's got a uh, a play to do and I've um, I can't go because who knows there's five of us in the house they give you two tickets from the school yeah so there you go never mind <laughs> so right thanks for watching um, feel, free, feel free to comment um, I haven't answered any questions lately like I say I haven't like from the last time I still haven't really been on there I mean I watched the, two videos this afternoon a um, couple of U, um, UK wheel horse blokes um, videos of him uh, rolling around on the uh, project why not That's, if, again, if you haven't seen any of them videos for that you, you need to watch it as that it's good and now it's up and running it's it's a really nice bit nice nice bit of kit you know um yeah anyway i'm not gonna ramble too much because i'm gonna go so thanks for watching and uh see you next time <laughs>